Okay, everyone, I am back. It has been about, let's see, ten, ten hours. So I'm going to go ahead. We're going to see how did it turn out. I think it's about nine o'clock. So six. PM made um, eight hours. Trying not to tear my box because I want to reuse it. trying to give it more time being that I use two boxes. But I would say it's set. So let's see. I'm trying to separate it from the cabinet liner. It did seep up under some, as you can see. I think I'm just going to go ahead and take this whole bottom piece out. If you look at my other video, you would see, you would know that um, I cut another box bottom out and then I wrap the um, cabinet liner around it. an exacto knife to cut this extra off. overall the mold came out good there so what I've learned most people before they take the mold out if it's any hanging over they just cut it before they take the mold out so let me just do that let me go around. Trying to be very careful. Let 
I just want to make sure that I don't have I would recommend putting some color to it, alcohol ink, so that way you would be able to um, recognize just to have some color so you'll be able to um, go ahead and outline your dominoes. But overall, I would say it did pretty good. I would say that a 10 by 10 um, box, if you can find one, is a great size. Basically, I'm just tracing around the dominoes. So I like this. I would definitely use it again. However, the next time I use it, I will make sure that I have something else that I need to um, make a mold of so I won't use two full bottles. I will probably use a one bottle and a half. This mold is pretty thick since I used two bottles. That mine just kind of dull. Okay. 
I'm just gonna go ahead and see what this one is kind of. Just go back and cut the extra off later. So, don't want this video to be too long. It smells pretty good. <laughs> it smells like candy. So let's see. So what I'm gonna do is cut the extras off on the siding. But I just wanted to come back and show you guys how my mold turned out. I end up using two bottles because one bottle did not cover. And I wished I would have had something else to make a mold of so I'd, I wouldn't have used two full bottles. But it's a learning process and you guys now would know before you make your mold to have something else to make a mold of so you can use like a bottle and a half so let's see how thick it is see how thick it is flexible it came out pretty good I'm just gonna go and cut the um, extra edges off. Okay, well, I hope you guys um, enjoyed this video. I'm whispering because my husband is in their sleep and I'm trying not to wake him. So if you have any questions, just leave them down in the comments and I will try my best to answer them. So that is it. I'm going to go ahead and stop the recording and finish um, taking off the additional um, the extra off and switch exacto knives because this one is kind of dull. Okay, well, I hope you guys um, enjoyed this video. Please like my channel. Um, I will be coming to you guys again to make another video on something else. Not really sure what it is quite yet, but that way we can learn together. And hopefully you guys can learn from my mistakes and not make the same mistakes. All right, don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel. Thank you guys for joining me. Have a good night.